What's up guys and welcome back to another video. As you guys can see, the AMG is right there. And I'm gonna be doing a video on it soon of what I think, my first impression of it and everything. But I just wanna say that I got the first modification for the AMG right here. You know I had to, it's Mando, carbon fiber lip. Picked it up on Opera for the low low. Lips are always somewhat expensive for the AMG or for the M. Um, they, always, they always cost for something. For something that breaks really, really fast, they do cost a pretty penny. Here's the AMG, it's really, really dirty. I've been driving it to work. Um, I'm trying to keep it OEM plus as possible. But yeah, guys, um, I'll probably pick this video back up probably tomorrow. I'm chilling right now to install that lip and uh, probably give it a car wash because I didn't know how hard, like, how hard it is to keep the black car clean but I also want to change the star and then some other things that I don't like about the car but I'll, I'll do a separate video of what I don't like about the car and what I like and just a lot of content on the car man so I'll pick you guys back up tomorrow or something what is up guys top of the morning top of the morning Picking up the video from a couple of days ago. Got the AMG um, jacked up. I'm gonna be installing this lip. Got my self tappers, my drill gun. Uh, I already 3M taped the corners because I feel like those are where it's gonna be the most hardest to get fitted right. Mm. This lines up to the OEM, so these are just two tabs. There's actually no video of an AMG c63 getting its lip put on so i'm gonna be the first one i mean there's other videos of like other c classes getting put on but there's actually no content on this car which is pretty crazy like it's a slept on car but this car is like fast it's good i i honestly guys if you guys are thinking about getting this car get that shit it's hard i'm not even gonna lie and i'm gonna be making a comparison uh the amg and the m to see which one is better but guys this shit has a lot of points on my end man i'm not even gonna cap it's so low key and it's just fast like this shit's crazy but my only complaint is like everybody's complaint front fender's wide rear's like what the fuck happened but let's get into putting this zip on and let's get right to the video all right guys so i'm under the car now so these are the two um front ones that the lip has that you're supposed to tap on and then the rest i'm just gonna self tap onto the bumper itself which is probably one two three or something these two 3m tape on the corners shouldn't be that hard but i'm gonna figure out what can i put right here to um well put a screw on there or something oh yeah guys it shouldn't be too hard probably a quick video because this is easy and fast i gotta put 3m tapes on the corners right here guys because it's like really hard to it just it, i don't know you guys know how it is it's these are not oem lips so it's always something with them but other than that the fitment is great you just gotta kind of heat that up and stick it on there all right guys the lip is on wow i should give it a different look excuse my car is shitty and dirty but lip is on all you guys need is a drill harbor freight and then just self tap your fucking shit on there look one two all the way down and i'm gonna get some uh screws or something right there let me get on there so you guys self tapper there you could put one on the side but i don't want to do that i kind of just three and taped it right there one two three four five six seven there's one down there sticking out, but my drill died, so I'm going to charge that and put it on. Other than that, guys, really, really simple install. Super easy. And it changed the look on the car, guys. I'm super excited about this lip. Can't wait to see it when it's low. I want lowering springs, but I don't know if my car already has them. Because the car looks pretty low compared to stock ones. But, yeah, guys, that's going to be it for today's video installing a carbon fiber lip on your c63 that's how the car looks off the jack 
It gives it a little, I mean, it's still high as you guys can see, but it's cool. Nothing like some lowering springs can't do. What do you guys think, man? Give this video a thumbs up if you like it. Any suggestions on these cars? Anybody that's going to be, that's going to watch these videos for this car or knows any information, leave down in the comments. Because I'm new to this platform. I'm not even sure. This is my first Mercedes. But, uh, yeah, I think it looks really good, guys. All I'm missing is the, uh, probably want some side skirts. Carbon mirror cabs. Basically the same revenue we did on the M. We're doing on the AMG side skirts. Of course, the diffuser. Um, get rid of this little duck tail and get the carbon one. And... Yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Probably get spacers. Because these wheels are tucked in. Gonna keep it OEM. Unless I find I'm not gonna get rid of these wheels unless I find some wheels that I really, really like and put it on there. But I'm not gonna be selling them even if I get other wheels. I just love OEM look on it, man. But leave it down in the comment section what wheels will look good on this car, man. And like I said, I'll guys catch you guys on the next one, man. Peace. Give this video a thumbs up.